Percy's theories of human becoming is one of the influential theories in nursing. It helps guide nurses as they care for the sick to focus on the quality of life their patients live as they go through that difficult time. Percy's theories of human becoming consisted of three structures, which are meaning, redmosity, and transcendency. Percy's theories of human becoming describe meaning as the experiences and reality that one live. The goal of practice with the human becoming theory is quality of life from the individual's perspective. Those not living the life cannot determine the quality of life. Therefore, the person is the only one who can describe his or her quality of life. The Parsi theory of human becoming guides nurses in their practice to focus on quality of life as it is described and lived. The human becoming theory methodology looks at the nurse two person and nurse to group situations. The participants and locations are contacts. The goal of the discipline of nursing is to enhance the quality of life from the persons and families and communities perspective. The human becoming theory of nursing presents as alternative to both conventional biomedical approach and biopsychosocial spiritual but still normative approach of most other theories of nursing. The theory was developed with three themes in mind which are meaning, transcendent and rhythmic city. Structuring meaning multidimensionally by analyzing and developing what was, is and will be. With meaning, the concept is valuing images and language through speaking versus being silent and movement versus stillness. Rhythmicity or rhythmical patterns is as the connection between the human and universe being a mutual process with the sense of cadent rhythms. The rhythmical patterns as a part of revealing versus concealing, enabling versus limiting and connecting versus separating and consisting of all realms in between. The human transcending means with unlimited possibilities of powering with pushing or resisting. Originating is part of transcendence with certainty or uncertainty and confirming versus not conforming. It is transforming with the familiar or the unfamiliar. The way Parsi's theory relate to 21st century nursing practice. Rosemary Parsi's theory has a transformative approach to all levels of nursing. It offers the discipline of nursing a broader perspective of viewing the human, universe and health process. This theory differs from traditional nursing process. This theory push forward thinking about mutual process, unitary human beings and the nations of freedom in situation. This theory formulates the ability to see patient's perspective, allowing nurse to be with patient and guide them toward desired health outcome. This theory also contributed greatly to the expansion of nursing knowledge through a unique view of human being as being structuring meaning, co-creating rhythms and co-transcending with possibilities. Through this theory, there was a nurse-person relationship is not particularly to seek fixed problems but to co-create changing health patterns. Case Scenario Mr. A, a 66-year-old diabetic patient, has not been compliant with diet or medication management. Mr. A is now in the hospital with kidney failure 
and he is scheduled for surgical placement of a dialysis access port. The nurse assigned to Mr. A listens to him and is in the presence of the patient during every interaction and has developed a trusting relationship. Mr. A discusses how he was ignored and avoided his health issues and did not live with the limitations that were being placed on him. In time, he realized it was probably not the best course of action to take regarding his health. Mr. A has agreed to have the dialysis port and has considered all the changes that are going to take place in his life now, and he has to take dialysis three times per week. Mr. A mentioned that he is having anxiety and he wants to learn about his disease. Mr. A has a goal of spending time with his grandchildren. He has a grandson who is graduating in less than seven months from elementary school, and he wants to make every effort to be there for the graduation. The nurse states that she would be glad to assist Mr. A to develop a plan that will allow him to reach his goals and hopes. Also, the healthcare team explained all the possible treatments. Moreover, they explained to the family members on how they can be involved in his goals. His family is very supportive and ready to learn and take part in any activities for Mr. A to fulfill his goals. He is looking sad and depressed, as evident by his low-pitched voice and uninterested in surroundings. According to the morning handoff report, he ate less, seems to be sad, did not say anything while being asked. In the evening shift, fortunately, the nurse has a trusting relationship with the patient. She also noticed the same thing from the morning shift. She also took his vital signs and grabbed a chair to sit and talk with him. I can see that he is sad. He looks hesitant. I noticed that you are feeling unwell today. Do you want to talk about it? I don't want to talk about it. I am tired and stressed. I will give you time to think about it, and you can give me a call whenever you are ready. I am always here to listen to your concerns. I need to help Mr. A and formulate a nursing care plan. I need to incorporate him in these plans too. I am worried about my dialysis. My goal is to spend time with my grandchildren. I am worried on what's going to happen. He is in pain, restless, and cannot sleep at night. I can conclude that he has anxiety. I do not I want, want him to be, be anxious. anxious. 
interventions assess the level of anxiety encourage the patient to verbalize his feelings provide the diversional therapy clarify the doubts and address the concerns properly rationals using pearce theory on eliminating meanings the nurse guide the patient without judging and labeling to explore his thoughts and feeling thank you doctor i believe that is mr a i think i am ready to tell my concerns and feelings i'll be there right away mr a I have to be honest with you, I ignored and did not listen to my doctors back then, and I never followed their instructions, and I just followed my own. Tell me more about it. I think it was not the best thing to do when you're sick. I think if I follow the doctor's instructions, my health won't be like this. What do you think about dialysis? Oh. I don't know what is going to happen, and what is it all about. Many people are in these circumstances and struggle in the same way. And I recognize that you are feeling upset. As a start, I could gather information for you. I would research and make illustrations and provide you a teaching about dialysis. Great! I am looking forward to it. Thank you. I am worried about my dialysis. I do not know anything about it. I am willing to know everything about it. He is confused and there is willingness to learn. He does not have sufficient knowledge on dialysis. Interventions Assess the level of knowledge. Assess the ability of the family to understand the teachings. Provide necessary education to the family. Clarify the doubts of the family. Rational. Since the patient is willing to make changes to his life, he becomes an active participant for his health by raising awareness through health teachings and education and include the family as a support tool the nurse gives the patient a choice about his health. The nurse guides the patient through life experiences without influencing the direction the patient will take. Mr. A, I am back with my resources. I am very thankful that you helped me. You helped me clarify my questions. You listened to my concerns and feelings, and you were not judgmental. You did not just consider me as another patient with a disease, but you treated me as a human with respect and dignity. For that, I am thankful. Evaluation decreased the level of anxiety. Patient improved their level of knowledge. Percy's model of human becoming emphasizes how individuals choose and bear responsibility for patterns of personal health. Percy's contend that the client, not the nurse, is the authority figure and decision maker. The nursing role involves helping individuals and families in choosing the possibility for changing the health process. 
Precisely, the nursing role consists of eliminating meaning, uncovering what was and what will be, synchronizing rhythms, leading through discussion, through recognized harmony, and mobilizing transcendency, dreaming of possibility and planning to reach them. Percy states that in true presence, the nurse's whole being is immersed with the client as the other eliminates the meaning of his or her situation and move beyond the moment. Nurses have the responsibility to help patients uncover meanings in their lives, harmonize rhythm and facilitate our transcendency. Percy's research explores and eliminates the meaning of human experiences such as suffering, courage, hope, grieving and everyday life. Her theory addresses the principle of human dignity and the models of family structure, mentoring, leading, following and teaching, learning.